Hey, what's going on guys? This is Jason S. here, Jones Acura in Lancaster. Just want to do a quick video on the Apple CarPlay system in the 2019-2020 Acura RDXs. Um, since I'm stuck at home, I got nothing else better to do. Uh, and it's raining outside right now, so I'm going to tackle some of these videos I've been putting off. So uh, this one is on the Apple CarPlay in the 19 and 20 RDXs. Um, just showing you how to use and operate things. Um, frequently asked questions, trying to get those answered here for you and everything along those lines. So uh, cut to the intro. So we're in my car, uh, I'm going to plug it in here. You do have to use that USB port that's in your center console area here. Uh, that is for your Apple CarPlay Android Auto capabilities. The other one that is located right down below there, that one is only for charging purposes uh, only. So go ahead and uh, get plugged in here. There we go. See Apple CarPlay lit up right there, so highlight again with the touchpad. Anywhere you have an icon on that screen with the Acura system, you just touch in that location and it's going to highlight. And you push down, and there's your Apple CarPlay. So, one thing that you get with Apple CarPlay is Apple Logic. So, what Apple Logic is is let me zoom in here a little bit so I can't just touch anywhere on this pad now with Apple logic you have to use the pad as a mouse all right so I'm gonna go down here pull up the widgets here for all my apps so there's all the apps you see multiple screens that you can slide through to get all the different apps that actually come through. So say I wanted to make a phone call to somebody, I just go right here and there's my contact list. Right there's all my favorites that are on my phone, everything along those lines are all right there. We've got recents, all right there. My actual contacts, you got the keyboard, and if I had any voicemails, which I try to keep those off, um, that would be in there. So, there's messages. Let's go into that. So, if I wanted to message someone, so let me uh, find Will here and send him a message. What do you want to say? I'm doing a video on Apple CarPlay in my RDX for everyone. Your message to Will Cross says I'm doing a video on Apple CarPlay in my RDX for everyone. Ready to send it? Yes. Okay, it's sent. So that's how that will work. When you get your Siri chime, you just wait until you hear Siri and talk to her as you normally would. Now what's really cool with this is you do have the Siri Eyes Free capabilities. So right there is your voice recognition button inside the car. This voice recognition button, if you just do a quick push, cancel. You get the car system, okay? Just like on your phone, you have to push and hold the button for Siri, push and hold this, call mom. Calling mom, mobile. 
So I'm calling my mom now. I'm going to end that call real quick. Hopefully she doesn't uh, call back. Wondering what was going on. But that's how uh, the Siri Eyes Free and Apple CarPlay kind of work. Now if you wanted to go into uh, say Waze, right there's your Waze. Oh, there she is. Had to cancel her. I'm sorry everyone. I do love my mom. So, uh, there's Waze. It's taking a little bit of time to load up. But let's say I want to go to work. Let's take US 30 East. There you go. And then, uh, just like uh, Waze tells you car accidents, uh, pedestrians, or uh, slow moving traffic, all that, you're going to get all that right here on the screen as you start driving. I'm going to cancel this. So again, right up top there, stop, right there. See over on the small screen, I do have my music information going on so uh, I do have that still unlike some other brands you don't get that music information um, you only get what you see up there one thing at a time so at least with our car you can get two bits of information you can have your map up here and you can have your music up here or you can just have your music and a small map um, so it's really nice go in here to music there's my music selections. Um, let's see, uh, Luke Combs' new album. There we go. All really easy. Now you see you have music on both sides. If I just highlight that, just by touching this side of the pad and push it down, it's going to flip to the car's map system. So, go down here. And then you have the three screen here showing you what's playing, your map, and uh, you know, it thinks I'm going to work, but I haven't been to work, unfortunately, in a few days uh, with this whole uh, pandemic so um, as I said I just want to do a quick video here I definitely uh, want to say thank you if you stayed the whole time watch this video definitely appreciate it if you had any questions comment down below I'll be sure to answer them as quickly as I can for you if you guys want to see more content go ahead hit the subscribe button right there and if you want to see more uh, videos that we have uh, on our site we have one popping up right there and right there. So I definitely appreciate it, guys. Take care and have a great day.